Hi, my name is uh, AJ Conroy, and this is my leadership interview video. Um, question one, explanation of why the interval was selected for the interview. I chose a man named Jack Kosher. Um, he's one of my father's competitors. He works for Helena Agri Enterprises. And um, contacted him a few weeks ago, and he's from out of state, but he actually let me know that he was coming through my area on Monday. Um, not on Monday, in advance, but coming through on the 16th on his way to a trade show in Fort Myers on the 18th. So he said uh, he could meet me up, or we could meet up for lunch and he could have a couple minutes to talk to me about what he, uh, how he took leadership and how he, what he does on a daily basis that relates to it and some words and phrases, traits to use that can help you along the way. Question two. The student's perceptions of the leader during the interview. I think that Mr. Kosher handled himself very professionally. He's a very uh, formal, like he's very, he knows when to be formal, he knows when to be informal, he knows when to be fun, and he's um, extremely down to earth. Um, Key leadership characteristics discussed by a person during the interview. He hit a lot on having compassion for others, building relationship building was a major thing for him. Um, he said the relationship you have with your clients and managers and people in your organization, group or company is what like makes the experience at the end of the day that much better. You like building a solid founding relationship with people will uh, always make you a valued leader in everybody's eyes, as well as in your own. Um, he touched on a point, he says it's extremely hard to keep everybody happy all the time, but all I can do is wake up every day and give it my 100%. And I think that's a a big thing when it comes to being a valued leader, in my opinion. Um, you're never gonna keep everybody completely satisfied. Nobody's ever gonna be constantly um, satisfied with a decision or point that got decided on, but all you can do as a leader is try your best in order to keep most of the people or all of the people uh, satisfied but as awesome as often as you can. So, um, what else did he say? Uh, prepare. He was a big guy on preparation. He does a lot of uh, um, I think that uh, Mr. Kosher does a great job of um, portraying, putting a picture to what this class, is, the class's definition of a valued leader is. Um, all the stories, events, and like we went through, um, he always hit on like how important it was being organized and proper preparation, uh, preparation keeping an open eye to uh, to keep an open eyes to the situation at all times. Um, never assuming, never jumping to conclusions, just taking time for others and um, some key leadership characteristics discussed by this person in an interview. He was uh, he very, he, he was good about keeping his eyes on the job at hand. That was, he said, that was a big thing about being a leader. Like, it's not easy, it's not for everybody. You have to make hard decisions, but knowing how to make the decisions can really influence um, the outcome of the situations. And going about the right way as far as how you handle it can uh, really help you out in the long run. He explains how, why it's so important to build a relationship with uh, your colleagues and group because without a relationship, you, it's very hard to depend or trust or rely on these people to uh, manage or get the job done that they're responsible for doing so. So um, I'd say relationship building was a big part of him. Um, your perception of the individual as the leader after the interview. 
I think that uh, Mr. Kosher does a phenomenal job. Like I like to think he used a lot of words and personal brands like that I like to think I ex ex uh, I express as a person and hope to be as a leader one day. Um, a lot of what I've learned throughout this class and, some, and other classes throughout my college experience about what a valued leader is supposed to be to a, uh, they're like a role model, somebody that can be looked up to, somebody that can be there, but then again, has the uh, capability to say no sometimes, to get the job done, to be that sense of authority um, that every, every organization and company needs. I'm really glad I got the time to uh, interview Mr. Kosher. He uh, did a very good job of portraying a lot of the traits and addressing like what a valued leader is as far as what he did it. And like, as far as I can tell, he, um, he's pretty spot on from what this class has taught me, what a valued leader is and what they need to do and how they need to act and go about situations to where they can be the most effective and efficient leader as they, uh, as they really can be. And um, I think that everything I've learned throughout this class and through my interview with him, I will stay with me a little long ways and I will definitely hopefully get to use it one day in the business world um, if I do find myself in one of these valuable leaders, uh, leadership positions. Thank you.